Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So when you run PC Health Check app on your computer and it says that this PC meets the Windows 11 requirements and but when you go to Windows Update on the right hand side it says this PC doesn't currently meet all the system requirements. So if this is what is happening then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now to go ahead and fix this, first of all, you can go to this link. The link is provided in the video description. Go ahead and check what is the minimum system requirement to install Windows 11 on your computer. So go ahead and check each and everything. Now once you are sure that your computer meets the minimum system requirement to install Windows 11, in that case you can go to this link. This link is also provided in the video description. You can use Windows 11 installation assistant to update to Windows 11. Now click on download now and then run this exe file. Click on yes to allow. Now over here if you are receiving this error message which says this PC doesn't meet the minimum system requirement to install Windows 11. In that case you can go ahead and use media creation tool to install Windows 11. So you can go ahead and close this window. Click on exit and then click on download now and this will go ahead and download the media creation tool for Windows 11. Now go ahead and run this exe file. Click on yes to allow and it will load media creation tool now. Now click on accept. Now again click on next. Now over here go ahead and select ISO file and then click on next. And then go ahead and select where you want to go ahead and save the file. So I will go ahead and select desktop and then click on save and let the download complete. Now this process will take time depending upon the speed of your internet. It will go ahead and download the file. Now once the download is complete, you can go ahead and click on finish and let the setup complete. Now go to the desktop and then make a double click on Windows ISO files. Now make a double click on setup.exe file and then click on yes to allow. Again, it will load the media creation tool. And now you have to go ahead and click on next. Now over here, when you click on it, here you can see download update drivers, optional features. So click on next and let the process complete. Now click on accept once again and let the update complete. Now you have to go ahead and click on install. Now over here you can see the option to keep personal files and app is checked. Now when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer. So you can go ahead and click on install and this will start installing Windows 11 on your computer. And once this is done you can go ahead and log into your computer and start using Windows 11. So that will be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.